Well, hello everybody, and uh, welcome to the uh, the next edition of Hobbies Australia. Show us your kits. We've we've done a couple of videos in recent weeks. Uh, this one tonight, we're going to focus on the brand Zvezda. Uh, we've had another shipment of uh, of product arrive in the last few days, and the pickup rate again on this uh, on this brand has been absolutely phenomenal. There's uh, there's four standout kits in this shipment that we're going to discuss and and review um, shortly. Um, and they cover a number of different scales, different topics. Um, so look, let's jump right into this, uh, and let's start with the the 170 second scale uh, medieval trebuchet. 49 pieces, um, retailing for $36.99. Um, for the war gamers, uh, this is going to be a, a really, really fun kit. Um, so we open up the box, sturdy top loading box. We've got. Um, a little clip lock bag with string in it that we're going to use to to uh, replicate all the ropes and bits and pieces on the trebuchet. Um, we have a sealed plastic bag with one, two, three sprues. Um, we have the, the traditional warning sheet that you would expect with, with any model nowadays. Um, and we have an A4 sheet of paper, uh, double fold out, okay, with the instructions. Okay, nice and simple, uh, a quick build, and I think this is one of these builds that, you know, you could knock this over on a Saturday afternoon if you wanted to. Spend a little bit more uh, time on this, um, and look, honestly, from my review on this kit, I, I believe, actually, if you wanted to, you could make this trebuchet work. Um, along the lines of the Academy range of Da Vinci models, which are, are functioning scale replicas of, of the designs of Leonardo Da Vinci, I think here's Vesda. Um, they've built themselves a, a nice, cool kit that the modeler is going to be able to have some fun building. Um, and as I said, with a little bit of attention to detail, with um, some care, um, you're going to be able to, to make this kit actually a functioning trebuchet. I'm seriously considering of, of building one of these and having it in the office on my desk, just so I can launch cool mints and tic tacs around the office, just for a little bit of fun. Um, okay, so let's have a look at the sprues. Three sprues. Really nicely, cleanly moulded. Um, they're flash free. Okay. Now, if we have a look here, we can see actually the wood detail. Um, and I hope Ryan can pick this up on the camera. Um, but we can see there the the wood grain. So once I've got this painted with a nice subtle wash, this is going to look really nice. Gear teeth, um, all within register, within scale. Um, it's not an overly complex kit. Um, these parts here. Obviously, these are parts of the counterweight. So, if I was going to make this work, what I'd do is use a product from Deluxe Materials called Liquid Gravity. I would put that into the counterweight box, and that would allow me to to get the momentum to get the the throwing arm working. Um, so, you know, this is certainly uh, not a model that's going to push people to their modelling limits. But this is just a good fun. It's a wet weekend afternoon build and it's going to be something really good again you know sprues are nice and clean they're crisply molded um, this is meant to replicate the top of the counterweight box which would have been uh, in its day filled with with rocks and stones etc so as you can see there the molded detail that's going to come up really nicely with some tonal variation from paints and then a wash that's going to look great all our, our hooks and our mechanism mounts and, and cross arms and um, split rings, etc., they're all within scale and register, and they really do look nice. Uh, again, this is going to be a nice box, uh, a nice kit, sorry, built straight out of the box, um, and it's going to be a little bit of fun. So, this is a kit that I would certainly recommend to somebody who's getting into the hobby. Um, certainly somebody who's a fan of medieval subjects and if you just want to build something different give it a give it a hit I think you're gonna really enjoy this so that's Zvezda kit 8516 uh, their medieval trebuchet retailing for $37 and that's available in stores now